What if I never find things pleasant? Man. I'm sad for you, Ben. <laughs> I'm sad for me, too. Hey, look, everybody. It's Tuco. <laughs> the balloonist. The balloonist. All I right. love that they all got names. <laughs> They're all different people. I don't know if I, I They're think They're clearly I the same person. That? It's different aliases right. because he's on the lamb. Oh, okay. Beast makers. When this beast makers world... When this beast burgers world. Sorry, this is a world for a world for uh, 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 people who make beasts. Yeah, I was always kind of confused by this name. So are they like, or are they doing weird who make mutation things? experiments? What's going on uh, here? They're just yeah, beasts who just make whatever yes. poop. Like there's a pie maker who just happens to be a beast. Yeah. I'm Rick, by the way. I'm Sarah. And oh, there we go. <laughs> you gotta give it a second, Rick. I gave it many pause. seconds. Said I ben gave it a few. Third person uh, on microphone today. <laughs> Who had to think is. about that one for a second? No, I thought about it correctly. I just couldn't make the sounds Brumo. correctly. With your word Nasty holes? Yeah. Word holes? How many word holes should I have? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but you said it plural. Oh. Nice, maybe. <laughs> I mean, depends. A lot of people can speak out of various orifices. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that's what, I mean, that's what I thought you were getting at. <laughs> That's where I'm going with it. <laughs> it's Aspire the Dragon. Yeah, it is. And, uh, wow, he really does stuff. look yeah, like a here. dragon, you know? He does uh, look like yeah, a dragon. Now, is he a Spyro who is a dragon, or is he a, a dragon oh who, is, who started as go? a spy spiral? Nailed it. Yeah. Uh, who, oh, dead? Who? No, I thought that was a th <laughs> There's a thing down one of them. One of them's a Quick, secret, damn it. Jump into the green goop. Uh, one which? of them's a secret, all right? Uh -huh. Who got to play the remaster? At E3. I did. Uh. You did. I did. Me and John both got our hands on it. And, and John played. And John, yeah, whatever. Uh, <laughs> also yeah, I mean, whatever. Guess. So, Rick, mm. you, I, you're the only person in this room who's played both. Yes. That is the <sighs> truth. How does the new one control? Uh, it controls... It controls very, very... Almost exactly the same. Okay. Uh, it feels a tiny bit tighter. Not a huge amount, though. It does feel a little bit... I, I still <laughs> ran in circles a couple times. Yeah. Do you do anything to those tiny trees? Oh, never mind. Uh, I'm thinking the, the most fire, fire but I don't think it really matters. Weirdly enough, the most significant difference was the camera. Since you can now... Oh, I guess so. Since you can now control it with the right stick. Uh, yeah. And interestingly, the camera is really slippery. Oh, okay. Like, I was having some... Tra it also was still inverted... I the, like inverted. Yeah, I know you do. Yeah. That's I know the way you it do. should be. But That's the thing is, I feel like they're going to give it to you as an inverted. option for settings, though. Probably. Like, I would hope so. It was X that's inverted. A, that's was a the common problem. thing to have as a setting. Oh, yeah. How many gems are here, by the way? Oh, um. 300. 300 and okay. two All right. Dragons. It's not too bad. Yeah, both oh, inverted. I keep trying to press circle to exit the menu uh, every <sighs> single time. It's a X terrible thing. X inverted is still weird for me. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, there's the there's one of the key. Why inverted is like no. perfectly right. natural and normal for normal people. X, what you want is, depending on the game, you may want Y inverted, especially if you're doing something that it's involves personal preference. It depends a I lot. I want them always inverted, both. Eh, I mean, it depends on the genre <laughs> for me. If I'm doing flying, I want down. Well, first of all, it wouldn't be right stick controls. It'd be like left stick controls, which maybe that's a difference too. But uh, stuff where you're flying. I want down to be up and up to be down. If I'm on the ground, though, in like a platform in particular, I want up to be up. Mm. Even if you're in third person? That's the thing. I'm I in think? third person. Oh, man. I need, I need to have my hands on the controller to really... Yeah. You don't like inverted generally. Well, at least for the X. Well, See, I don't know about maybe Y. I'm thinking, I can't in really shooters, I, in anything with a, with a gun, I definitely want... Uh, See, but I'd argue that's completely different because the way you're, you're yeah. you know. That's what I was saying. It depends on the genre. It really does. So yeah, I, d I did a lot of third person, like especially like MMOs and stuff. So yeah. uh, left and right being normal is fine, nope, but up nope, and down nope. I need inverted because I was looking. I look at it as like the, con the camera is behind the head of the character, right. right? Right. So if you press down, the camera, the back of the camera goes down, so you're actually looking up. Right. Right, so whatever. As to me, I think it always I got so used to it. I then I got so used to it. If I go first person, I still need to do it that way because oh, no weird. Used to doing it that way. See, for me, see, I the more I'm thinking about it, in first person, I like to have. In first person, I like to have it be inverted. First person oh, okay. or anything with a reticle, like a shooter, a, a flying game, 
Because those, I mean, that for flying games, it's basically the same as an, as an actual like like a flight, flight stick. stick. Yeah, you you pull back to go up, not down. Oh, nice. That's the key. And I guess you're yep. doing like a first person like shoot or something. If you're looking down the gun, then if you kind of press you down to yeah on the to handle like lift to lift up because yeah, you're like yeah. pressing down on the back of the gun. Right. If I were to we're going with like a rifle, I guess is our yeah. example. But still, but then third person, I think I do like to have up be up. Oh. Oh, extra life. Yay. This place is weird. It's like it's not sprawling exactly. It's just like it's got a, a lot of little pieces. It's a strange swamp area. Yeah. That's kind of this whole place. Wow, thing. fuck. That's a lot of crystals. Gems. They're gems, Rick? Oh, I'm sorry. What is wrong with you? Maybe I was looking at a hologram. This is an affront to the United Gem Society. Wow. I'm sorry that you are now the representative. I know that that takes a lot of time and energy away from your hobbies. <laughs> oh, fuck. Thanks for your concern. You're welcome. <laughs> that is all. Oh wow, that was actually nice. Thank you for thinking. It was about a telegram. Me. I didn't know how to end it. Right. It's right. always awkward. It's the <laughs> answer machine of the 18th century. I like how the telegrams always ended with end. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, all stop, stop and end. <laughs> yeah, or stop. Yeah, yeah. Or no, stops for the sentence. Stops, stops for sentence. Yeah. Stop is period. And end is for. Cletus. Like they couldn't figure that out. They could <laughs> just. Put a fucking. They put periods. It'd be like, "Hello, period, stop, period." Yeah. Like, I, I assume that it was a trait. Like, it was a thing that came over. I with feel like there's occasion. I don't think there were periods. Actually, that might be something that people added afterwards. I want to and assume. I also, whoa! Ah, fuck you. I want to assume nowhere. that it was a holdover from Morse code. And yeah. they didn't really have a good way to indicate I also, a I don't dot know. I think it's when that everything's whole, made of dots. You want to be clear about the end of a sentence because sure. there's ambiguity otherwise. Now, is this the one? This looks this like the one. This is the one. Yep. There's no I green. told you there was like one. There's yeah, there's no green in it. <laughs> yeah, but look, I forgot which one it was and I just kind of jumped. <laughs> hey, you didn't die or anything. Everything turned out just perfectly fine. So, right. Is that our know. flight level? D-flight. D Wild, Wild flight. flight. All D-flight. Okay, yeah, so we got, got everything. Yes, we did. Gemarinos. So neat. So we can jump into one of our first levels here. Oh, my God. Pick me up, magical rainbow. Before you go, magical rainbow. Sorry. Before you go, 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 magical rainbow. Oh, pick. <laughs> yeah, go, 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 magical rainbow. So where is this to a first? hub? The first world? What's that? Yeah, this is a hub world. Yeah, it's a uh, hub, yeah. So this was the to? first world. So you've well, completed the hub. Right, let's jump uh, in. Terrace, Terrace Village. Village. Oh, I went to high school Wee! with a guy named Terrace Village. I, I doubt it. <laughs> oh, man. Rick's gone so, to high uh, school with so many people. I know. So uh, when when we were in L.A., uh, we called for a lift to get out of to get out of there at one point, and uh, we were to head back to the hotel. Wow, hello. Hi. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. And I looked down, and my... Our, our Lyft driver was named Taras. T A R A S. Oh, tar interesting. Yeah, I've never seen the name before. It might be Taras. I don't know. But so I we're standing at the intersection. It's pretty busy. We see the car pull up on the other side, and he steps out of his car. And he's kind of stretching for a minute, and he's kind of looking in our vague direction, but not at us. And I and I raise my hand to about head level, and I'm about to yell his name, and then I stop, and I pull it back down. And John's like, "What was that all about?" I was like. You know, it's probably not a great idea to, to in a crowded intersection to yell Terrace. <laughs> I feel like I some people might take it the wrong way. <laughs> eh, it's, yeah, it's, it's fair. Uh, yeah. Eh. Yeah. It's not even me trying to make a joke. In the right. moment, I no, almost no, no, did. It no. was like, maybe I shouldn't no, I don't do th that. I didn't think it was funny enough to be a joke. It like, <laughs> <laughs> <Wow>. oh, <laughs> that was. I only bring it up because it was such an absurd <laughs> little moment. Yeah, and and just like. Huh, I wonder if people would actually have been like, I'm sorry, what? If I just yelled Terrace? I also feel like there's one of those things where it's like, are you pronouncing it right? That's my word. I don't know. I could have said Taras. <laughs> yeah. Tara. Maybe it's I guess a silent if you, S. If you say like a question, you kind of take the edge off of it. Yeah, if like, I go, like, feel like, Terrace? Uh, Terrace? <laughs> but if I go, Terrace! Like, yeah, everyone's yeah, going to yeah. go, oh, shit! Yeah. And like, hit the deck. So. There was a bunch of gems. Yes, that there was. was. My, I was that was my okay, cool. Just to totally sure. hilarious lift story. It was one of those things where, like, right at the edge of the screen. I don't know if you yeah. saw. Anyway. Oh, extra life! Yay! Yeah, it was a barrel of laughs. I do keep them in w in whiskey barrels. I'm just uh, I'm just bitter that I didn't get to go to E3. That's I was so <laughs> sad. <laughs> I really like, wanted no, you to be uh, there. It's not your fault. I know, like, but I really. A shitty set of it's gonna happen. We know what date it is for next year. Yeah. So. 
We can make that happen. Like I, I definitely would have been able to go if You're not. You're not gonna for attack the guy and get his gems. Yeah, I was uh, gonna take the a chicken out first. Oh. Oh hey, I missed one. G- See, it's a good, good thing you checked. See, look, look yeah. at that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, if not for, I got hit with car repairs, like, yeah, right that was, before, it was like over such a, thou- a bummer on timing. Not quite a thousand, right around a thousand dollars to rough. get my car going yeah. again. It was like, that just took, and you kind of need that. It took the wind out of my financial sa- uh, sales. No. Oh, Watch out, rough. Spyro. So. Watch out, Spyro. Yeah, I guess I get. I could have just like not had a car and then lost uh, my that'd job. That'd be bad. <laughs> <laughs> but on the plus side, or you paid get to go large to amounts of money for yeah. a lift, thus paying thousand yeah. dollars eventually, and then still <laughs> no, not that's having the, a car. That's the big one. Next time we go, we're either a uh, getting a hotel much much closer to. We got a hotel in Long Beach, which meant uh, forty five minutes to an hour to ride in because that's of traffic. A lot. And it costs like thirty-five bucks minimum to 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 for that ride. Yeah, that's one way. Whoop. Oh, okay. Yeah, those are like long distance rockets. <laughs> cool. So that's uh, oh, that's thirty dollars uh, oh, that you got yeah. to split, or thirty dollars each. Uh oh, that was thirty-five dollars per ride. And right. But I'm assuming you. I'm assuming you took the same lift. Yes. Right. That's Which so we. I mean, we alternated trips. I think overall we probably got. Let's see, one, two, God damn it, the dead three. body we, blocked We would have gotten about eight lifts over the course of the uh, the week. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Plus a couple There's intermediate a ones here and there. Yeah, if you're going to go and like, get dinner or whatever. Yeah. yeah. So we each spent at least 120 bucks uh, on lifts I alone. All the chicken. So yeah. either we're just going to get a hotel that's closer or we're going to just rent a car. We were we were probably debating. similar price at the car rental. Oh, uh-huh. it's, it would easily be less by the time we were done. Fair enough. Especially split between the two of us. Uh oh, that's still active. Uh, yeah, I was just trying to see if I could find a chicken before going for it. I feel like it would be. Oh yeah, oh. I was gonna say it might be too early. Too early. <laughs> I feel the problem like is the distance is so hard to travel. Yeah. Sometimes you wanna. I feel like it would be a real pain to like rent a car and drive in like an unfamiliar city with like oh a, probably a known for a sh- the, the nice the part is traffic. GPSs are at least that's true. Yeah. Also, LA is laid out reasonably. Uh, Sanely. reasonably. I guess, yeah, it's not Boston, right? So. Yeah. God, Boston. Why are Boston you so is, bad? Boston is absolutely atrocious for driving around. The part that drives me crazy is the lack of lane lines in some places. They're just not marked. Oh, yeah. oh damn. Oh, you fuck. Really? That sucks. Is there anything around this? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I, like, don't drive around here at all. Oh, like, I if I have to go it. anywhere, if I'm I just like, I have it, a I car, don't. but I'm not going to use it. it I sucks. was actually mildly relieved when my car got totaled. Uh, almost immediately upon moving to, to well, Summerville. Well, shit, I, just, I should just total my car. Yeah, dude. <laughs> All the cool kids are doing it. Yeah. Like me. I just need a... Yes. Oh, can you climb up that behind you? This? No, I'm yeah. going to get up that later. Okay. I just need a All sweet job I where I, make, I can make money from home. Ah, uh, um. yes. The trick is clicking on lots of ads. <laughs> Because I mean, apparently lots of people are making thousands of dollars from home every day if you just click their link. One could oh, argue that as software Oh, look at this guy. <laughs> yeah, but then I have to learn how to make software. <laughs> or engineer it, at least. <laughs> or survey. <laughs> All sorts of surveys. Yeah. yeah. That guy looks like he, uh, was it, uh, Hedonist Bot? He, no, Hedonist I was bot? looking <laughs> sexy Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's more of a lean backwards, not a lean sideways. <laughs> Do you really have no, to I'm specify him, sexy like, Jeff Goldblum? No, I'm thinking of him, like, on the, the, the tape. Well, he was doing yeah, all he that posing. backwards. Like... He's leaning backwards, but he's on one arm. I think there's an enemy behind you still, too. Yeah, there's two directions I can go. Oh, no, I mean, like, where you came from, though. Him? Yeah. There you go. I don't know. I'm just, you know, trying to help, you know, keep you help you keep track. Oh, God, missed. Shit. That's the thing. The running controls. You just can't really make a tight circle is the problem. That is obnoxious with these electric dudes. That's kind of what I was getting at with the controls on the new game. Like, do yeah. they tighten that up at all? Dashing or? is not considerably is not considerably improved. If I'm right. if I'm honest. I mean, that might charging I mean, that is, could just yeah, be a balancing point. Charging. Like, you know, that's that's how the game is supposed yeah. to be. Like, it's not like you, yeah, they you were just going, don't turn on a dime. They were clearly going for making the remake feel as close to the original as possible, which sure. you know, for better or worse. Yeah. And the the running controls were still a little bit tricky. Yeah, I, I didn't mean, have to use yeah. them terribly much, but I don't know. 
I don't know. I think that with the camera, it'll make a big difference because a lot of the stuff that always slows you down is the trying to get positioned properly. Yeah. And just having the ability to keep it centered behind your head well, is kind of huge, in my opinion. The worst is when you're trying to run and you just narrowly miss your dude, and then it's like, well, they're definitely going to hit me now. Uh, if you aim properly, Ooh, there's nah. stuff to the left there. Yeah, I was going to try and murder some of these guys. Yeah, first, well. murder the yeah. fuck out of them. Oh, uh, see what I mean? I, no, I dodged left. That was my problem. Well, yeah, no, that's what I mean, though, is like once you once you miss them even by a little bit, you're pretty much just screwed. You're donezo. Oh, no, my Dr. problem Dunzo. there was that I'd run out of time. It, w it had nothing to do with whether or not... Yeah, ran, um, I mean, sort of. You ran past him was the thing. Yes, but my, I mean, my problem was just more that there was no more time left in that particular enemy. For a lot of stuff, you can just keep dodging around and it's not as big of a deal. Mm. Anyone that's got those like electric zap bolts seem to seem to be almost guaranteed to hit you if you Basi don't. Kill basically, them what fast. I'm saying is this game is garbage. No, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Mm -hmm. False. I, I didn't <laughs> <you>. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> Untruth. Uh, Dis distruth. Mistruth. Is there anything to your right? What alternative you? fact. Oop, okay. <laughs> This game does feel like it has uh, quite a bit of charm to it. Uh, yeah. Having even having never played it, like when it doesn't seem it doesn't seem like it aged particularly well, but also didn't not age poorly. particularly horribly. Yeah, right. yeah. <laughs> it but it still looks very charming and fun. I would say that this fe it looks better than it looks better than Donkey Kong sixty four. I can't decide whether it. I think it. I don't know if it plays better. I think Donkey Kong 64 plays slightly better. And I think both uh, are slightly less good at both of those than, like, Banjo-Kazooie. Which isn't to say that it's bad. It's just, like, there's sort of this realm of 3D platform games in the in the mid-late 90s that all kind of fall into the, the same. Best. It's okay. What's that? I said Banjo-Tooie is just the best. It's okay. I can uh, Banjo-Tooie, I can never decide if I like it better or worse than uh, the Banjo-Kazooie. <sighs> I think it's more refined. I think my biggest problem is that it just keeps going a little bit too long. Yeah. The, the, it's great, The but interweaving of the levels makes it a little bit frustrating sometimes because it means you have to revisit places a little more than you might like. So it does feel like it's stretching itself out by arbitrarily kind of blocking stuff off. It's actually it does similar get a to the problems that have been... frustrating occasionally. Well, it's similar to the problems I've been hearing about ukulele, too. Um, I, d Not I couldn't even extreme, get back into that game. I just... I uh, wanted to like it so badly, but it was oh, so left, left, left. terrible. Yeah. What's our number, by the way? Is it 400? I think so. Yeah. yeah. Okay. They're probably all going to just be on these rooftops. Then. Yeah. You just have to remember that to come back here is the trick. Yeah. Did we get that guy before? Yes. I murdered him, but then I died. Remember? Okay. I, was, I just didn't know if we'd gotten him before we died. <laughs> I do remember that time you got fucked up. <laughs> I can double check, but I'm pretty sure I murdered him. I just didn't need to re-murder him. Where are these you know? fireworks going? There's Ooh, two chests. Oh boy! I thought hmm. you guys are gonna bust open those chests. See, there's that chest yeah. there, and then there's the other chest that was on the ground. Oh, I thought you blew that up open. with another firework before. But I that blew up the, the one that was next to it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Do, 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 do. There should be basically everything but that blue one now, uh, or the blue. Oh wow! Okay, I thought it was a small blue board. One. That you should be that's it. it. Mm. It's like Earthbound. Yeah, you're not dead until your counter says zero. <laughs> Man, I gotta, I gotta fucking play Earthbound. Do we, maybe we should play. Maybe we should play that sometime after oh, done with Chrono Trigger. Isn't that game actually kind of hard though? Um, I've heard that's that what you have Rick for. I've heard <laughs> the. I mean, I'm. I yeah. have never played it all the way through. Yeah. I have no clue. Uh, I've heard it gets pretty tough around the halfway point. Yeah. One of the big problems with the game that makes it a little difficult for us in particular is that it can be tedious. There are chunks where, like, tedium sets in for specific missions, but that's a story for another day, and we'll see you when that day happens, which is not today. Bye. Later.